Greetings, I'm C. Henry Adams and you're listening to Social Networking with C. Henry Adams and the crew. Very first thing I want to say is Happy Valentine's Day to all the beautiful ladies. That's right, I said it. Happy Valentine's Day to all the beautiful ladies. Social Networking with C. Henry Adams and the crew discuss information technology and advanced technology that benefits small to medium-sized business. Stay tuned. Today on Social Networking with C. Henry Adams and the crew, we will interview Mr. Ray Ortega. He is the president of Hispanic Marketing Group in the Atlanta metropolitan area. Hi, kids. Hi, Mr. Davis. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Okay. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and your face is really show. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Kiki, why are you so happy? Because my mom bought me a scooter, right, CD? A Scooter Red CD? Yeah! What's the Scooter Red? The Pizza Demand! Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah! yeah! I'm straight from champagne, no drain on my brain. My name is Scooter Red, the born is dropping game. I'm always stuck dealing, dealing. I used to be still and still, but nowadays all I do is write off some living. Oh, some of y'all don't understand the way that I feel. Cause when I flip the page, you ask me, are you ill? Why in the world do y'all think something's wrong? Is it because I ain't trying to sound like the dog? Most people, what is that? Is it was a thing bad? Is only black all these whack police and all these happy jeans only keep us dollar seekers always thinking just because I might sound crazy don't mean that I ain't happy. One song don't mean you know me. I'm Scooter Resident. You feel me now, G? We're for the money. Uh uh-uh. uh. Two more to show. Uh uh-uh. uh. Three to be ready. Uh uh-uh. uh. But here you go. Uh huh. We're for the money. Uh uh-uh. uh. Two more to show. Uh uh-uh. uh. Three to be ready. Uh uh-uh. uh. But here you go. Uh-huh. I got my head up on this mic and my mind is on a mission. I'm trying to move those and feel this vibe that I'm kicking. Some people say that my songs are way out because of the type of things I talk about. But I don't give up. When none of y'all think you put no food on my table or money in my bank account or what they would you talk about. Or don't you know I'm supposed to get punched in the mouth? Cause mighty people always got something to say. So if you don't feel me home and then don't push play. A hitty jacket on my CD got the window. And hey, once he take over. Like a Lee Roy Brown, I'm that crazy boy in your town And you can feel the vibe, the mouth around I know your haters are probably saying, shut up now But it's too late now, I got to see One for the money, uh-uh, two for the show, uh-uh Renew for ready, uh-uh, but here you go uh-huh. One for the money, uh-uh, two for the show, uh-uh Renew for ready, uh-uh, but here you go uh-huh. One for the money, uh-uh, two for the show, uh-uh Renew for ready, uh-uh, but here you go uh-huh. One for the money, uh-uh now throw your hands up in the air and if you're feeling me now And if you like what I'm doing, go ahead and get loud I see a party, ain't a party, none less you having fun So are you cool cats? And you'll tell them to the front Cause see y'all screwed around and what they told you about The one that's up in the party, you turn that mother out I'm only doing the same because I'm going to say Ain't no drain on my brain cause I'm bringing the pain I got you safe One for the money, uh-uh. two for the show uh-uh. Three looking ready, uh-uh. well here you go Hello, I'm C. Henry Adams, and we're here with Mr. Ray Ortega, and he is the president. What is the name of your organization, Mr. Ortega? Hispanic Marketing Group. Hispanic Marketing Group. We are glad to have him 
We have been trying several times to actually perform this interview. On my end, I just want to apologize to you, Mr. Ortega, and thank you so very much for giving us the opportunity to redo the interview. So that being said, Mr. Ortega, could you tell us a little bit about your company? My pleasure to be talking to you about this subject. The name of the company is Hispanic Marketing Group. We have been in business since 1999. We produce major events at the same time. We also represent other companies that are marketing different products. Now, Mr. Ortega, I'm going to ask you something unique. I'm going to ask you if you could repeat that in Spanish for those listeners that don't speak English and would like to hear what you just said in Spanish. Mucho placer, Mr. Adams. Mi compañía se llama Spanish Marketing Group. Nosotros producimos eventos. Además, representamos a diferentes corporaciones en diferentes programas. Gracias. Now, we have been talking about information technology and advanced technology. And you shared with us that one of the things that the Hispanic Marketing Group is doing to, to help make its business better is turn green technology into something effective. And you said something about one of the ways you turn green technology in your office is that you actually use a different type of lighting. Yes, sir. We do have a sister company. It is in the area of advanced technology. In, for example, we represent the, the latest in energy solutions, which is T5 light. These are the lights that are third generation, and they save between 40 to 60 percent of the existing lighting of any uh, company uh, or government agency. 40 to 60 percent energy is saved due to this type of lighting that you have in your facility. Am I correct? Yes, sir. Would you say how has Hispanic Marketing Group helped its customers use technology? First, we use it ourselves, and then visiting different of, uh, government offices to okay. offer the technology. You know, we, not, we also offer the solar panels, big tank for big offices that they have a lot of hot water that yeah. they have to use. Yeah, so sorry. we offer that one. It's a, it's a tank that it is uh, very new in the market, and it's a, it was discovered in in Germany, and it's being transferred here in the United States. Okay, so to understand just what you said, you said that you have solar panels that, that heat hot water, and right. the product was made in Germany, am I correct? The solar panels are being manufactured in India. Okay. And in China. Okay. The tanks are being manufactured in Germany. Okay. And then we are the exclusive distributor in the United States. Okay. Well, let me ask you this. Do you think that we Americans could possibly uh, come up with a way to create solar panels and and the hot, the hot water tanks here in America, just looking at the European and the, I guess you could say that's the Asian region and how they're building stuff, maybe we could come up with an idea to do that for our small business projects and to help save money for our small business. What do you think about that? Yeah, but that is very, very good. I remember that the, I don't know if you know the cells that are inscrusted in the panels. Mm -hmm. They are manufactured in Duluth. Okay. And and because of that, the you know the when you manufacture the cell, then we send it. They send it to China to put it together, okay. and then they send it back to us. Okay. And one of these days, it will be good if the government provides incentive to these companies so the the labor costs are not that high and the products are not on competitive price wise. But but the sales now are being made here in, in, in Duluth, Georgia and shipped to China and, and then the product the pro, the problem is that the product is so popular that Europe and China and India are using most of the products. Okay, so that's pretty interesting. So so basically they made the sales in Duluth, Georgia, and they shift them to China, which China would then manufacture the cells into a solar panel. Right. Export, uh -huh. isn't it? That's right. Okay, and you use the solar panels and the, the hot water tank actually in your facility. Am I correct? We use the lights oh. because the, the building that we have is not big enough for the tanks. These okay. are large tanks. 
Okay. And the solar panels are not because they're not they're primarily used in a big uh, conglomerate of buildings. Okay. As uh, uh, because the volume is what may make the product cause uh, you know the, the saving that that you get is is is, is justify the cost. Okay. In a small locations, uh, it's very uh, difficult to justify the cost. Okay. It's, it's, but the the product are being used in houses. Okay. And they also are being used in hospitals, okay. and they are being used in you know larger clinics. Okay. Is Hispanic Marketing Group uh, working to to bring that technology to the Atlanta area in the Hispanic community? But we are trying, yes, sir. Okay, would that be like some project that you have in the future? Well, we are. We already have. I mean, right now we are promoting the the product within the federal government. Okay. Within the commercials, we do, but we don't. We are because of the, the the technology is pretty high cost. Right. Some of our customers residences or hospitals. Okay. Uh, for example, the VA hospitals are using this technology nationwide. Okay, so they're actually using the, the solar panels with the hot water tanks nationwide yes. in right. the VA hospitals. Right, VA hospitals. Okay. That really sounds great. It is a great technology. It is, like I mentioned it to you, it saves a lot of energy cost. At the same time, is it's good for big installations where you can reduce your budget by at least 40% when you are computing your energy cost. And you say you reduce your budget about 40%? About 40% on the energy side. Okay, that's really great. These solar panels send energy back down the grid, the electric grid, to, to the power plant? That's I mean, right. Well, but to the, uh, you know, you, you have the, from the grid to the building. Okay. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So you can send power back down the grid, the electric grid, and, and get money from, say, Georgia Power? Sure. Uh, there's, there's some project in the West Coast that they are doing that. Okay. The, the generation of power is so much that the power companies are buying that and, and you know, and then reselling it. Okay. Now, I want to ask you a question, not trying to get away from the advanced technology, but I want to ask you about the conference, not, not the conference, but the event you got coming up at Atlantic City. In Atlantic Station. Station. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying Atlantic Station. Atlantic. All right. Uh, yeah, this is an event that we are that we have been planning for the next, uh, you know, last three weeks. I mean, three months. Okay. And it will be uh, uh, April the 17th, and okay. we will have we will have a concert type presentation. Plus, we have exhibitors from major corporations, and food from, you know, different international cities. Okay, and what is the name of that event for people who want to check it out at Atlantic Station? Yeah, that's that's a Feria Latina. They can visit our site, which is www.ferialatinaonline.com. Okay. Or they can call us at 404-321-0663. 4432106636. Yes, sir. Okay. We I believe we posted it on our Facebook page and I most definitely would make sure that we put it out there in the Twitter world. Thank you so very much, Mr. Ortega. I'm always honored to talk with you and thank you for telling us about the solar panels and that you actually help market. I mean that's that's a great thing that your organization doing and if you could just give us the name of your organization one more time and the telephone number just in case someone want to contact you yeah it is hispanic marketing group telephone is 404-321-0663 thank you so very much well thank you mr adams uh, we are always uh, here to help and anybody that you know want to participate call us and we will be glad to serve them <music>